Hi folks, I'm Josh, and this is more Mushroom 11. Chapter 3, Escape to the Country. The, uh, the mushroom is apparently tired of its uh, stressful city life. Purple, purple goo trying to eat it. Oh, it's trying out some speed running. And also, it's having a little splish splash in the water. Oh yeah, it's, it's bath time with rubber ducky. My, my buddy, my pal, my, my long-time friend. But I can't do that in the bath. Uh, <laughs> I, re I really don't know how you're supposed to do it properly, like, consistently. I can't always do it. But basically, you get rid of yourself, and then you sploosh out of the water. Uh, hang on, let's get ourselves over there. I see you, Mr. Fly. You're not you're not running away. Clearly you think we're best of friends. So, um let's become a bit more than that, you know? Oh, high five. <laughs> nice. Nice. I've decided that this mushroom is probably just completely benign. It's doing its thing. I've been, I I read a book recently about grey goo scenarios and that's kind of what this is oh <gasps> what is this cat cow oil cow oil they sp they spread the cow oil to the many fields and and tributaries around this area and that's how future agriculture happens that's that's actually a kind of cool story i think in the background here there's lots of um, broken down machinery and broken pesticide sprayers. So I think, yeah, like this thing, there were clearly tons, tons of bugs. There was probably one of one of the many apocalyptic scenarios in which locusts take over the world. You can go for it. Too. That one there. There we go. Nom nom nom. Oh no! Oh, that's so cute. They run away. There's no hiding. Oh, you you survived inside me longer than most. That that's a really creepy thing to say, and I I wish to never repeat it. Yeah, that I I was thinking about this, and uh, last time I I quickly had a a look at this level, and there's a lot of cl clear agricultural breakdown. Stuff is apparently still working. <gasps> <Boop. laughs> Let's go around this way. It'll be faster than having to climb over all your stuff. It's nice that the windmill? No. Mill of some kind. It waits for me if I'm in the way. Oh, there's, there's a button. Oh! Oh no! Oh, and there's fire! Don't you dare try and get me murdered. Okay, let's press that and launch it into the thing in my way. Oh, 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 no. That was, that was in fact unsuccessful. Okay, let's, boop. Try this on for size. Oh, that was, that was actually a really good shot. Well done. Oh, you better fall over. You cheeky little haystack. Oh no, not in the lava. I guess if you've got a nearby volcano, that's a really efficient method of getting rid of sp spare hay. If you've, if all your cows are di dead because of locusts or what's that, some kind of ant, and your M M4 isn't doing the job, whatever this is, um, then yeah, just throw all of your stuff into the nearest volcano. You're not doing anything with your post-apocalyptic life. So you may as well <laughs> start worshipping worshipping big mountains with fire coming out of them. They're like hay. <laughs> and also, they're like hay. S stop putting dead grass in me. I'm hot enough as it is. Oh, oh grab on. Hold, hold it. Hold on. Good job. Hold well on. I like the physics puzzles so far. They've been pretty simple. Oh, I've been warned about a bit later though. I haven't, a bit I haven't gotten to, so. 
I guess we'll see when I come to that. Squidge. Oh, yeah. Flowing through your pipes. That's what you want. <laughs> Lots of fiber. Um. Zoop. Zoop, zoop. Okay. Wow, that worked really well. All right, let's go this way. Squidge! Oh, now I'm the volcano. Oh, maybe that was one of the apocalyptic events. It seems that there are either many or just some likely ones. Can we can we spray me in a in a viable direction, please? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Nice. Almost. Uh, boop. Oh no! No! That was... <laughs> unsuccessful. Okay. Squidge you down into a nice firm pate. Fall, please. We don't have time for this. <laughs> The thing about mushrooms is that I think they're the largest organisms on on earth, right? That's the f that's the one weird fact about mushrooms that I know. I I think that's what they were talking about in the inter interview. I can't get back on that thing now. Oh dear. Um in the interview with the de developers, they were like, did you know the largest thing on Earth is a mushroom? And I'm like, oh my goodness, pizza. And they're like, oh my goodness, mushroom pizza. That would be world's biggest pizza? Yes, please. Spray me. Seriously, though. Oh, that's no good. Nope, not that way. Just put put it in the hole. No, I why why is this not working anymore? Yeah, okay, cool. <laughs> Check it. And sploosh again. Cool. There's no hiding for me. Oh. Oh, well, that's kind of grim. Wow. Now we know what they use for scarecrows in the post-apocalypse. Wow, okay. Could you maybe move that way? Thank you. <laughs> so considerate. I'm trying to get you over there. Yay! A little push and a shove. Keep the door open. Thanks. Cool. Is it possible? Oh, we could make a bridge. Oh, we can play poly bridge. If I was any but good at poly poly bridge, then I'd be really happy about this particular puzzle. Yay. Well, that was like level one of poly bridge, so I think we're fine. <laughs> Oh no, I was I was all set to get a really good bounce there. Yay! Well, I got high enough. Oh, okay, I think I've got it. You need to go really deep, and there, and then while you're up there, you don't get rid of yourself because you can't grow in a direction while you're up there. Right? Yeah. We got this. Oh, we got we're we're on target. Oh, hang on. Why is there a Why is there a ledge there? What's what's the ledge for? Why is there a ledge there? I don't know. Oh, it's so inst if you can't if you can't grow, if you're not a grower, you you can be a shower by 
showing up all your friends and kind of going around that curve thing. I'm gonna try bouncing because hooking into the into the, the nubbin. It's not working for me. Oh my goodness, just thank you. <laughs> and you, I can, I can deal with you. Eh. Okay, yeah, it seems like Robo Agriculture Bot couldn't get rid of the, uh, of all the pests and had decided that the human overlords, they weren't really doing anything. They were all, you know, their skeletons had escaped. So he tried to scare, scare away the, the, the pests with some good old-fashioned scarecrows. Do you mind? Thank you. <laughs> I don't... I'm not entirely sure. Oh, okay. Can I... Yay! Oh, that works quite well. I can lean on it. Just put a little bit of pressure on one side. And there... There's your pressure plate puzzle. Sorted. Nom 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 nom. Oh, it's like a... It's like a... Testicle ladder. <laughs> it's... <laughs> I, I, that's what it is! I'm not being rude. That just might be how you're set up. But seriously. Go see a doctor. <laughs> Why is there a... Oh, there are so many testicle ladders all over the place. <laughs> what am I doing with this wooden X? Oh, I see. I see what I'm doing. I'm, I'm using it as some kind of... Booster. Okay, go. Gra <laughs> grab onto the nuts. <laughs> have, a, have a good feel. Oh. Oh, it's growing all over the place. It's growing all around them, just having a... <laughs> I mean, it gets the job done, right? But it's also a really creepy thought to have something just kind of balancing on your... <laughs> anyway, I... I apologize for my... <laughs> for my tangent. Uh, oh no. Oh, okay. It's not testicles. Oh, it might be testicles. There's some kind of... This, this is... This boss is all about the nuts. It's... It's... <laughs> balls central. Ah! Explody... Caustic things. Okay. We do... We do what we did with the hay bale. It's like that bit in the movie where you're like... I know this. Ah, uh, except you're also really awful. Don't get cocky, kid. And go get it. Oh! Oh, you little babies. They're in the water now. That is what I would call disgusting. Oh, no, they're not testicles. They're ovaries, which are like lady, lady nuts. But on the inside. It's an inside job. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Right. Um, I don't know why you are continuing, continuously sending these things at me. It's really not doing you any good. Oh, it's splurging everywhere. Let's run away from this thing. Oh no, that could hurt us. That could kill us. Should we Can we do anything with all these roots and stuff? No, no. Never mind. Hey, it's a human. Well, it's a skellington. It's a skellington human. Let's have a good old climb. Oh, uh, 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 uh. oh! I feel really bleh, like nails on a chalkboard. That. <laughs> oh no! It's it squidges out in three different directions. <laughs> oh, oh, I am the toothpaste monster. 
<laughs> oh, oh, there's so much horrible imagery going on right now. Oh. If only this was just post-apocalyptic and not some kind of gruesome carry-on movie. <laughs> wow. Okay, well. It looks like Blobby here lives to fight another day. Thanks for watching. I'm going to be playing so much more of this. If you have enjoyed the video, then thumbs up and let me know what you think of the game. And if you really enjoyed it, then I have a Patreon. And until next time, bye-bye.